What's up, YouTube? Tim and Logan back with another one. A little bit rainy today, so we decided we're gonna go under the bridge, see what happens here. Can't guarantee we're gonna catch anything, but you know, we're gonna give it a try. We'll, we'll see what happens. They say the fish bite in the rain, but you know how that goes. It's like in the 60s, a couple miles an hour for the wind. Little echo under the bridge here. This is ridiculous though, guys. First of all, let me just say this. Whoever's back here doing all this crap, y'all are disgusting. You really need to change your habits. Just saying. I wish I could pick all this up, but this is this is nonsense, guys. Come on. Who's doing all this crap here? You're gonna ruin the fishing spot for everybody, and the DEC is gonna shut it down. Nobody's gonna be able to fish here. Then y'all gonna be happy? Probably not. Anyways. We're gonna get into fishing here. I don't know what I'm gonna tie on first. We'll see. I'll let you know. Probably just a wacky rig or something. We'll see what happens. Anyways, we'll get set up. We'll see y'all out there. Logan got his first pumpkin seed already. Look at the size of that guy. Put it in my hand. Try to turn and get it in the light. Nice job, bro. There you go. That's a keeper. Yeah, buddy. Wait, are we actually keeping any? No, we're not gonna keep any. Come on, we got some trout at home we can eat. Yeah, yeah, the point. Here. Yeah, I got some white wall that look good. Guys, that one's beautiful. Look at that. Nice job, dude. So Logan's just using a small plastic uh, crappie rig. I'm going with the gulp minnow. <clears throat> we'll see what happens. I'm gonna try to get over by those docks over there, see if we can hit a bass. Yes, he did. I had one, guys. I am using a barbless hook here. Barbless circle hook. Probably not the best thing to be using, but that's what I'm using. Let's see if we can get over here a little more flat-footed. First cast. Doesn't count though, because I didn't get him up. We got a little look at him. He was only about a pound. Wow, thunder heavy rain. Thin line between joy and pain. Get it, thin line. <laughs> Said get it, thin line. Between joy and pain?
Always gotta have worms. <clears throat> the old go-to. You know, when I was a kid, I used to go and walk from my aunt's house to the creek. I didn't have enough money to buy worms, so you know what I would use? Um, the chewing gum. Bright green chewing gum, and I used to catch trout on it. He's on it, he's on it. Nice bluegill. There we go. That's what I'm talking about, guys. That's a nice bluegill. All right, guys, look at that one. He's a fatty. We can do that again, guys. He's on there, guys. He just whipped it. Oh my goodness, he was all the way over there. Look at that little guy. <laughs> um, that's what I would call a sunfish, actually. That's what you call a sunny, guys. Doing the same trick as we did yesterday with the trout. We're gonna watch that line and see when it starts taking off. Pick up that slack a little bit, adjust it. Hopefully, should be on there. Let's go.
grabbed it quick. Hopefully he's still got it. Yeah, he's still got it. Oh, what the? The smallest fish I've ever saw. <laughs> Can I lip him? I lipped him, guys. Look at that little guy. You see that, dude? It's just a baby bluegill. Getting fired up now, guys. My hands aren't so cold anymore, suddenly. Got it, he's got it. Does he have it though? Yeah, he's got it. That's another nice bluegill. Wow. Yo, he is fat. Holy crap, guys. Oh, he just peed all over too. Chill, bro, chill, bro.